probably the MakerBot, the new uh, dual filament MakerBot. Oh, it's a 3D printer, so you can uh, design uh, items in 3D, and then you just print to it like a regular printer, and it, it's got a little XY thing, and it prints it out for you. Well, that sounds pretty cool. You should go check it out. An Android phone that was waterproof. It was the world's thinnest smartphone. I think uh, Fujitsu. The coolest camera I've seen is a new camera from Panasonic, which I'm probably going to crumble and buy. I'm trying to talk myself out of it, but I'm not doing a very good job. What's so cool about it? Uh, well, it's got this, it's this new four-thirds uh, standard thing, and it's very small, and I've got a bunch of lenses that are going to fit it real nice. I like the gaming mouse over there, the MMO uh, Rat 7. Well, it actually has adjustable, uh, you could pull it out, make it longer, bigger. It's got buttons everywhere, which is uh, always a plus, I guess. There was a nice video game chair over in the, in the, in the south hall yesterday that we were looking at with the surround, surround screens and everything. Nice. Told the wife that's my new recliner. <laughs> <laughs> there are some great speakers over here, really thin speakers by Liquid Bass. Yeah. Pretty cool. Love to hear them. I'd have to say the OLED screen from LG. Uh, yeah. Yeah, pretty amazingly thin. So. My favorite thing is this transparent um, kind of interactive window that they had over at, uh, I believe it was Samsung. And it even had these virtual blinds that you could pull down and it would make it close the window. But the coolest thing was how you can check out the weather, you can check out Twitter, all the things that you do on your computer. Uh, you could do through this transparent window. So my goal is to get one of those in every window surface in my life. 